A familiar face in the Twin Cities is now considering running for the state's newest seat, as we first told you Friday. Well, new tonight, Darnisha Mitchell talks with former Bloomington mayor about his potentially new legislative endeavor. Former Bloomington Mayor Terry Renner may not be done with politics after all. Renner is considering a run for the newly created 91st district seat in the Senate legislature. He cites experience as a mayor and 30 years in academics, currently a professor at Illinois Wesleyan University. We can come a long way in Springfield by opening the doors to things and letting the public feel like, even if they don't agree with what their state government's doing, that they feel like their state government is listening to them. That House district covers East Peoria, Washington, Carlock, and Bloomington Normal. The seat was part of the newly redrawn map signed into law by Governor J.B. Pritzker earlier this month. Brad McMillan, executive director of the Leadership Institute at Bradley University, says Bloomington Normal and Bartonville areas tend to lean more Democratic. He says 60 percent of the Twin Cities voted Democrat in the 2020 election, giving Renner, a Democrat, the advantage. He says connecting the Twin Cities with East Peoria could bring advantages. The two communities can work together uh, to, pro to promote economic growth. Uh, Rivian is kind of uh, in between both of them um, in hiring a lot of people for their new electric truck vehicles. And I think that's good for the whole central Illinois region. Renner says he'll spend some time reflecting on his decision to join the Illinois House before next year's Democratic primaries. I'm Darnisha Mitchell, 25 News. And that same Bradley staffer says because the 91st seat in the House is new, he eventually expects a lot of interest from both political parties.